Hello everybody, myself Meghna Ranjit. I am a rehabilitation psychologist working at Prayatna Center for Child Development. As we all know, digital devices play an important role in our lives today. Digital devices like smartphones, smart watches, tablets, media, they all play an important role in our lives today. They are very essential communication devices and they help us as well as our children in understanding and learning many things that is going around us. And today we cannot imagine living without these digital devices. But nowadays many parents approach us. They are tensed, worried and concerned about their children's excessive gadget usage. They tell us they try to take it away from them. But their children get very angry or frustrated and they display very inappropriate or unacceptable behavior. So today I will be sharing with you few tips to reduce your child's excessive gadget usage. Tip number one, setting proper time. By setting proper time as parents, you can track and restrict your child's or the amount of time your child is spending on screens. But remember, please don't allow your children to use mobiles after the allotted time. And by doing so, as parents, you can improve the habit of routine in your children. And this will prevent your children from using mobiles for a longer period. Tip number two, active supervision. Your child will be using digital devices for many purposes. They will be playing games online or they will be gathering much information. But many a times, your child won't be aware of his or her posture, the distance from the screen, that is the eye distance from the screen and also the screen brightness. So through active supervision, you will be able to correct the posture and also it gives you an opportunity to co-engage with your child in the screens or in viewing the screens. Co-engaging with your child will facilitate uh, social interaction, bonding and also learning. Many a times, knowingly or unknowingly, your child can view some adult content in the media or in the gadgets. And co-engaging or interacting with your child will help you to explain to him the pros and cons of getting into adult sites or any difficulties which he or she is facing and help him or her to overcome them. Tip number three, encourage outdoor play. Encourage unstructured outdoor play to improve your child's physical abilities and these will help to channelize your child's energy. By um, engaging your child in outdoor activities, this will help to stimulate your brain and your child will be active, active and alert throughout the day. So yes, like online play, offline play is a must and make sure your child gets ample amount of time outside to engage in physical activities. These will improve your child's gross motor skills, fine motor skills and will help your child to be active and alert throughout the day. Tip number four, avoid using technology as emotional pacifiers. We all know digital devices, especially our smartphones, are excellent tools to distract and calm your children, especially when you are feeding them or <clears throat> when you are changing their clothes or when you are traveling with them. Yes, these are very effective tools, but remember, these should not be the only tools which you are using to manage your child's emotions. As parents, help your child to understand or identify and manage their challenging emotions. Find out activities or strategies to manage their boredom, facilitate open communication and come up with new ways to help them cope with their emotions. Tip number five and the most important tip, be a good model. Your children are great observers and they are looking at you. And they are mimicking your habits so limit the amount of time you are spending on your screens start to interact with your child play with them hug them rather than just staying at your screens so do try to implement the above mentioned tips be consistent progress will be slow but wait patiently but still if you're finding it difficult to manage or restrict your child's excessive gadget usage do consult a professional who is experienced in dealing with children and their difficulties. Thank you.